Hey guys, Wet Movie One back here again for a little Blu-ray hunting video for you guys today. This may be a little short one. Uh, me and my family are going to be going to Porter Ranch, California. You know, just a little bit of a different area uh, to go shopping today, where they have like you know uh, Best Buy and Walmart and some other like you know supermarkets and stuff. So we're going to be going over there food shopping, but you know I'm going to be going to look for some Blu-rays and things. So uh, let's see if this Best Buy that I haven't been to. And like, I don't know, six months, if they ha still have the movie section, because the one near me where I live, they got rid of it. So let's head on out, see what we can find today. First stop of the day is Target. I'm going to head on in. Let's see what they have movie-wise. Who knows when you're going to see this video, but, you know, I'm just stocking up on, on video, so I never go a week without one, you know? And like I said, keep in mind, the, ones, the two places I'm going to today, I don't normally frequent. You know what I mean? Like the, the certain stores I'm going to, the ones I, I go to are in a different town. So uh, hopefully these ones actually have the movie sections. Now seeing what they have over here, this is definitely not like a, a hoarding up kind of video or anything. It's not being filmed on a Tuesday. It's actually, what's it called? August 5th? No, August 6th right now. Uh, as I'm uh, recording this one, seeing what they got going. So I don't, like I said, normally come to these stores as often uh, anymore since like, you know, I have the, you know, the full-time job now. But uh, Guardians of the Galaxy 3, never seen it. I still need to get a copy of this. I don't have a, a physical copy of Scream 6. May maybe sometime today, or maybe if I uh, wait until like CD Trader has it, or one of my used stores. But still, a lot of the areas are still like emptied over here, but... Ooh! I forgot this came out to 4K. Ferris Bueller's Day Off, definitely one of my favorite uh, favorites growing up like you know this and uh, 16 candles breakfast club and stuff, but on 4k um, 25 is kind of steep, but this is definitely gonna have to be a pickup if I find a better deal everything else kind of looks the same from even t the, like a the couple of months ago when I came into a <laughs> Came into a target. It's mostly books in here now uh, and, and the sections and records and stuff but when it comes to physical media, at least they have some. At least, at least they have some new, of the new releases, ish stuff like Scream Six and stuff. Over at the next stop of the day, Walmart. This parking lot is busy. Oh boy, oh boy. Just made it in here. Had to duck through the baby aisle where they have like the under, <laughs> the diapers and stuff. So many people in this Walmart right now. I don't do good with big, 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 big crowds. Over here at the new release rack at, uh, at Walmart over here, they do have, of course, Guardians uh, up here, The Last of Us, which I uh, have a copy of at home. I haven't watched it yet, but of course, Scream 6 is a couple bucks cheaper here than it is at uh, uh, over there at um, Target, but we shall see. We shall see. I do have it on digital with my buddy Cody in the House of Geek and stuff. I still haven't seen the way the way of water but i don't know if i have the the interest in it or not you know like the first one was fine but i think i've only ever watched the movie twice and i only kind of liked it because of the way it looked in the theater like the 3d aspect of the original uh avatar movie but other than that you know that's that's pretty much it but they are putting out some cool box sets i'm sure some of you guys have seen these already like ed ed and eddie and uh bones the complete series is out right here the Beetlejuice uh, box sets out right there, and Growing Pains. And recently, I saw a post on um, I forgot what, what website it was, but they're putting out like the complete series, kind of like this, but of um, step by step. Now that's cool. I'm gonna probably have to get up on that. Um, I already have Growing Pains already, like on separate releases uh, that I got from MovieZing.com, which is cool. I always have a link to their website down below if you guys ever want to see uh, what MovieZing. They're like a burn on demand company. And they put out some cool, they put out some uh, you know cool stuff out there, but I'm just trying to peruse the shelves because, like I said, I don't normally come out to these stores as often. Uh, I used to come out like once a week and do these doing like hoarding up videos, but uh, since I, since I got the new job, I don't do it on a regular anymore. So it's kind of you know I, I kind of don't keep up with the game as much. Are you afraid of the dark too? They made it, that's cool. I didn't know they even made a second one. I bought the first one when it came out. Probably haven't even opened opened it yet. I heard decent things about De Death Stream, a uh, Shutter original. I heard some decent things about that one. But yeah, if, if you guys watch the videos on a regular, I bought this one. I still have to watch it. Um, I bought it from like CD Trader and a, a couple of videos back. But just on the hunt, if I find anything cool, 
I'll definitely let you know if I, uh, you know, jump on anything. But, you know, my best friend's a vampire. I think this might be one of the packages, uh, one of the little packages I'm going to open up at the end of this video that I got from Lionsgate. It's like, I have <laughs> so many different little things that show up, and I have to do some unboxings and talk to talk about some of these titles Good, sometime soon. Uh, Backlash 2023. I love me my wrestling stuff. At least Walmart does have a, a better section than Target does. Uh, for sure. I think they probably always will. Compared to like Target and Best Buy. Just got out of Walmart. So many people in there. My anxiety was kind of kind of going crazy up in there. Like so many people. It's like in, in every single aisle. Anyway you turn. Someone's coming around the corner. I get it. It's the weekend. And kids are starting to go back to school in a little bit. <sighs> But you know, things you have to deal with sometimes with my mental disabilities. Off to the last stop of the day, the good old Best Buy. Hopefully I find something cool in there that I uh, want to get up on. And it looks like they still have the the new releases and like at least an aisle of the Blu-rays and, and DVDs, the one by my house, did that whole remodel and doesn't they don't have that kind of stuff anymore. They don't even have the new release rack like this uh, anymore where I live. In, in my in my area, they do have Knock the Cabin Steelbook still. They got the 4K of one of my favorite movies of all time, 35.99. Damn, I'll wait. <laughs> I'll wait. I think there's a Criterion sale going on uh, right now as we speak. <sighs> Ferris Bueller, Bueller, Bueller. They got some other steelbooks over here. I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen already, like the Two Guns and the Mission Impossible ones. Uh, they have going on in here. I really have no interest in this. And for $30, I definitely have no interest in that. These two steelbooks are kind of cool though. Cliffhanger is a, a, a classic, especially the cover from uh, when I was growing up in the video store days. Crank was a good movie. The Crank and Crank 2 were both fun. Bo both super fun movies. This thing's kind of cool looking. Uh, all three, uh, or at least three of the John Wick movies uh, in a big like Bible looking set. That's cool. Not $80 cool though. At least in my <laughs> in my opinion over here. But to be honest, guys, I don't see myself getting anything uh, out here in the wild today. Stuff's kind of expensive in these kind of stores, at least as of right now. But I do have some packages uh, to open up, so let's head on home and open those things up. Because the only stuff I did get today was uh, like you know like food and drink stuff for the house. You know what I mean? But I do have some packages here, some of which have been sitting around a while that I got from uh, different uh, you know, studios and PR companies that send me stuff to showcase for videos to let people know that they're out on physical media to get. So uh, let's crack into this and see what we have. Uh, please keep this in mind. I'm filming this video the day after uh, Dragon Fest. So it's August 6th uh, right now as I'm filming this. So let's see what's in package number one. Oh, this one I think is already... On the store shelves already? This is August 6th. I'll look at the paperwork, but I got Fast X on a 4K uh, right here, the collector's edition. Actually, I'm not sure if it's out yet as, as, I'm, as the time I'm filming this. By the time you're watching this, it might be a different story. But we got Fast X on a 4K right here. That's pretty cool. Uh, I was kind of into the franchise when it first started, like the first two or three. Then like after Tokyo Drift, I kind of you know, didn't really keep up with it anymore. But um, I did watch I did watch them all, but like, you know what I mean, like, religiously and stuff. But we got Fast X right there. We got the paperwork in here from Universal Home Entertainment. And it comes, oh, so by, by the time you're watching this video, it's already out. It's coming out on 4K and Blu-ray August 8th. So it's most likely in stores now uh, as I'm filming this video right here uh, from Universal Home Entertainment. Always cool to get a physical media release of a film. Uh, out there, as you guys can see behind me, I'm a big physical media guy. Fast X on 4K. Thank you, Universal. Out now. But we got another package uh, right here. So we have three packages we're opening uh, for this video. Let's see. What is this one? What is this one right here? What is this one? Oh, okay. This is what I kind of thought it was going to be. From Lionsgate Home Entertainment. It's been sitting, sitting over here for a while for me to open for a video. And that is My Boyfriend's a Vampire. The Vestron Video Line uh, label right here. I know I've seen this one during like the VHS days uh, and stuff. I don't know if I've ever had like a DVD version of it like that. But uh, this is definitely one I'm going to have to jump on and watch real soon. 
Uh, it gives me this cover kind of gives me nostalgia vibes, and some of the pictures in the back, I'm like, oh, I remember this movie, you know. But I have to watch it again to like refresh my memory and stuff. But as of right now, this is in stores everywhere, as you guys saw on the shelves and in, in this video, it's in like it's in Walmart and Best Buy and stuff like that. Uh, I believe my buddy Michael Felsher uh, from Red Shirt Pictures uh, did the special features, uh, you know, for for the for this release and for a lot of the other uh, Vestron video. Uh, collector series editions that uh, Lionsgate's put out, so uh, that's always cool. Uh, got to you know, we got to support my bro, uh, Michael Felsher, uh, right there. Red shirt pictures in the house, but that's cool. That's in stores now everywhere, and we got one last package here from FedEx, and uh, I think this one says, I think this one says Rancho Cucamonga two. Let's see, I think this, I think this might be Warner Brothers or Universal. I'm not sure. But we shall find out in just a moment here. Oh, Warner Brothers. Oh, ho, 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 ho. since I just got back from Dragon Fest yesterday, what a perfect release to get. The original OG Bruce Lee classic, Enter the Dragon, finally released on a 4K right here. The new uh, artwork right there. Classic uh, Kung Fu martial art movie right there. Uh, it says includes both theatrical and special edition version of uh, special edition version of the movie, including introduction by Linda Lee, and commentary uh, on here by some film film historians. Uh, this is so cool. I like the artwork. I just don't like that thing. Like my buddy Even Garrett from Born to Be Rad. I don't know. I don't know about this label thing. You know, what I mean, this hundred hundred year kind of label they're doing on these things. I don't know, but uh, I like the, I like the artwork itself. I think it's cool. I know there's I think there's different editions. Like out there for like like steel books and you know uh, like you know different like uh, you know different editions of the 4K uh, put out by Warner Brothers. But I love me some Enter the Dragon. I even have my old laser disc uh, signed by Mr. Bolo Young uh, when I met him a few months ago. And uh, this is so cool to add to my collection. I've had multiple different versions of this movie, uh, you know, throughout the years. Of course, you know VHS, DVD, all that jazz. And uh, this one's being released on. Uh, August 8th, so by the time you're watching this, it is in stores uh, everywhere. I got my little Warner Brothers paperwork uh, right here letting me know, uh, you know, the dates and uh, all that jazz. And uh, it's also available to purchase on digital. If you guys do the whole digital thing, like Voodoo or whatever, you can get it on Voodoo right now. And this is all also celebrating the 50th uh, anniversary of Into the Dragon, which is just amazing, dude. De definitely, definitely a Kung Fu classic. Uh, right here, so let me know down below. Are you guys gonna be picking up uh, any of these uh, any of these movies in stores? Or did you guys already pick them up? You know, Fast X, My Boyfriend's a Vampire, or Enter the Dragon. Let me know in the comments down below. And thank you guys so much for watching. That's all I really have to show and talk to you guys about today. Catch you guys on the next one. Please give this video a thumbs up if you guys support the videos. And remember, hit the join button if you guys want to get my get early access to my YouTube channel. And my YouTube videos, uh, you know, that's that's what my little perk is here. If you guys want to help support the channel and stuff like that, check out the join button. And I'll see you guys next time.